Damari, I guess, I guess you guys got to settle for 59, but uh, just your thoughts on tonight's game. Uh, you know, uh, there was no resting or anything. You guys played it like any other regular season game, trying to get 60. Uh, yeah, you know, we played. You know, we had a goal set out. That was when 60 game before, you know, this 82 was up. That didn't happen. Now, you know, time to clear that. None of that matters now. You know, get ready for this weekend. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you said it best there. I mean, it, whether you would have won it or not, it doesn't matter right now. Um, you look at the bracket, and Washington's one of the last two teams to knock you guys out. Mind you, it was a few years ago. Teams have, are different. Things change. But does it give you any extra incentive at all? I mean, you can use it, you know, as an incentive, motivation, whatever you want at this point. Whatever's motivating, push you. Um, the guys that was here. Remember that feeling, leaving Washington game four. Knows what it's like, knows what it's like. Um, and that's something that we could use to put that chip on our shoulders, so be it. So, but other than that, you know, we, we just got to get ready. How prepared do you guys feel right now, Demar, when you look at the way you've changed your style? I mean, even tonight, uh, you drive down the lane and you attract everybody and DeLon gets a wide open three. Like, just things like that, different for, for this year going forward. Uh, yeah, it was big, you know. <laughs> we don't get 59 wins for for no reason and you know the bar the, the records we set not just you know what wins but statistically the things that we was able to, able to do um, from behind the arc um, passing um, points per game you know everything so I think all that speaks values. Does it feel differently this year DeMar for you and the team going into the playoffs? Yeah yeah um, the hunger the, the the push the you know the the, the pain of, of you know of the grind um, in the all season and you know the fails from previous years um, kind of carrying that all over so it definitely feels different how much different are you personally the team you think from last year's playoffs even two years ago playoffs um, like I said you know we, we went we went through the the fails over the years and you know whenever you can you could gain any type of experience like that you know um, you know if you if you fell a test and you realize you know what you need to study on to be better and next go around. You're gonna be better if you put that 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 mental approach and that physical approach into to the things you need to do to be better. And I think that's what we did. And and you know, like I said, you know, can't wait for this weekend. You know, you're gonna obviously get the best punch from Washington, but you gotta walk into the saying, "Hey, we are the number one seat. You gotta beat us with the number one seat." Ah, uh, yeah. You know, you carry that over. That's confident booster. Say we didn't win as many games for nothing, but you know now it's time for us to take it to another level. We can't rely on what we did during the season record-wise. Now we gotta take it to another level and understand we could be we could be a lot better. Does it even matter who you guys are gonna play in the first round? Man, no, I'm, I, no, I, no. As long as we playing, that's all that matters. That's all that matters. You know, now we know who we playing. Let's get ready.